Kawata, a member of parliament, was this morning, the 30th of March 2020, left in tears after narrating before the Lusaka's magistrate court how he has not been able to recover from the humiliation and pain of being beaten by a cadre. Mr. Gavin Lubinda, who is also Justice Minister, told court that the pain and embarrassment he went through on the material day is something that is hard to recover from. The Justice Minister was testifying in a case in which he has dragged five patriotic front cadres to court for allegedly assaulting him. In this matter, Martin Mambwe, Patrick Mubanga, Major Chancellor, Moses Mulenga and Godson Mwinge have been found with a case to answer for proposing violence to Mr. Luinda after the state closed its case. It is alleged that Martin Mambwe on 12th July 2019 assaulted Mr. Luinda, occasioning him actual bodily harm. Appearing before Lusaka's magistrate Lamek Mwale for continued trial, Mr. Luwinda told court that on the day in question, the marketeers were happy to see him, however, was shocked when what seems to be a group of ordinary youths started uttering insults to him. The accused are said to have called him useless while accusing him of destroying the PF party and that ever since he was elected Kawata member of parliament, he has neglected them and was only benefiting with his family. Mr. Luwinda told court that amidst the commotion, Martin Mamwe slapped punched and kicked him after calling him by MP. The minister told court that he felt pain and hot on his face after Martin Mamwe blessed him with a slap. He says with the help of his bodyguard, they managed to leave the scene and reported the matter to Kawata police station. The state witness, who was emotional, told court that he is fearful for the country and wonders who is safe if a minister with state protection 24-7 can be beaten by a cutter in public. The Kawata area member of parliament told court that he has saved his people with honesty and it was sad that during his tour at the market he was beaten by a cadre who wanted to continue terrorizing the marketeers. The matter comes up on 24th of April 2020. Miriam Kaimba reporting for Movie TV News in Lusaka.